In the world of finance, two terms often come to the forefront, trading and investing. While they might seem synonymous to the uninitiated, they represent two distinct approaches to growing wealth. This article delves deep into the differences between trading and investing and makes a compelling case for why investing is a superior strategy for long-term wealth accumulation. Definition and Time Horizon Trading Trading refers to the act of buying and selling securities frequently, with the primary goal of profiting from short-term price fluctuations. Traders typically hold onto assets for short durations, ranging from a few seconds to a few months. Investing, investing, on the other hand, is the process of allocating money into assets with the expectation of generating a profit over a longer time frame. Investors tend to hold onto their assets for years or even decades, focusing on long-term growth. Objective and Approach Trading Traders aim to capitalize on market inefficiencies and price discrepancies. They often employ technical analysis, studying price charts and patterns, to predict future price movements. Investing, investors focus on an asset's intrinsic value. They use fundamental analysis, examining economic, financial, and other qualitative and quantitative factors to determine an asset's true worth and potential for long-term growth. Risk and return trading, given its short-term nature, trading can be highly volatile. While traders can achieve significant returns, they are also exposed to substantial risks. The frequent buying and selling can lead to high transaction costs, and the rapid fluctuations can result in significant losses. Investing is generally considered less risky than trading. By holding onto assets for a longer duration, investors can ride out market volatility and benefit from the compounding effect, where returns are reinvested to generate additional earnings over time. Trading can be emotionally taxing. The constant need to monitor the market and make quick decisions can lead to stress and impulsive actions. Investing promotes a more relaxed approach. Since investors are in it for the long haul, they are less perturbed by short-term market fluctuations and can make more rational decisions based on thorough research. Frequent trading incurs higher transaction costs due to brokerage fees, taxes, and other charges. Over time, these costs can significantly erode profits. With a buy and hold strategy, investors face lower transaction costs. The reduced frequency of buying and selling means fewer fees and a larger portion of the returns remains with the investor. History has shown that, over extended periods, markets tend to rise. Investors, with their long-term horizon, are better positioned to capitalize on this upward trajectory. Albert Einstein once referred to compound interest as the eighth wonder of the world. By reinvesting returns, investors can exponentially increase their wealth over time. Without the need for constant market monitoring and decision making, investing offers a more peaceful and less emotionally draining experience. The reduced transaction fees and tax implications make investing a more cost-effective approach to wealth accumulation. With a focus on fundamental analysis, investors base their decisions on comprehensive research, leading to more informed and rational choices. In conclusion, while both trading and investing have their merits, for those seeking sustainable, long-term growth with reduced risks and costs, investing emerges as the clear winner. It's a strategy that requires patience, research, and discipline, but the potential rewards make it well worth the effort.